Tommy, defeat out there tonight in the National League Cup. What are your thoughts after that one? Um, well, they're still going round in my head. Um, but for a lot of a lot of it is very clear to me in that a lot of the people who played in this game are playing in this game for the right reasons. Um, and what the outcome of the game has proven to me is that I'm right. Yeah, I mean, it was a defeat against 10 men, wasn't it? Do you think maybe we should have taken more control and, and got a higher up scoreline when we were 1-0 up? I don't think we could have taken much more control than we did. We had absolute control of the game. So, you know, with their Premier League athleticism, you know, um, good coaching and obviously. But we've, we've dominated the game moment, like from the moment the lad's gone off, really. But, you know, to have that amount of dominance in that length of time, um, I would expect that group of players to have put the game to bed. They didn't. Um, we had to make a couple of changes to look after one or two of the lads for the weekend. Because um, this competition is you have, to, you have to play at least four who played yeah. on Saturday and or four who are going to play on Saturday. So that was that was the thing behind the substitutions. But the fact that we went from winning, well, leading the game to losing the game, getting ourselves back into it and then losing it again, um, shows more, of merit, more, in my opinion, than what's left on the pitch at the end. Um, there was some good football played from us today, didn't we? And we no, did. Listen, I'm not. I'm not saying that we haven't played well. We played yeah. some really good football against a very talented and fit, athletic squad. But ultimately, our lads aren't a lot older than theirs. Some of them, mm. um, some of them are vastly older than theirs. And without, you know, I, I keep my powder dry in terms of what I feel, you know, in here about individuals and collectives sometimes. But I think you can tell that. One or two people are very walking a very very thin lane at this moment in time, and um, yeah, things might have to change a little bit. And we did create a few chances, didn't we? I mean, we hit the post twice, so maybe we're a little unfortunate to not be further in front. But I mean, do you think there's a more of an issue not scoring today, or was it just more well, up scored, the other end? Scored two goals at home yeah. against ten men. How, how can it be? The, how can that be not enough? I mean, I don't get that. Like, when, mm. If people can't see where there's an issue, then then they don't know what they're looking at. I mean. At the end of the day, how do you let people in your box put you on your backside in the 93rd minute? Not one person, not two people, not even three people. And then have a free shot from five yards out or whatever he is. It's just yeah, unacceptable. And the main thing we didn't want from any of the games in this competition was injuries, was it? We wanted to keep everyone fit. Yeah, I don't blame the games. Don't give me that because at the end of the day, we're a full-time outfit. Yeah. We're fit. There are so many players at this football club who tell me they should be playing every week and they are not 90 minutes fit. People will have a go at me. It's my job. It's, is it? It's their job. It's their responsibility as individuals to make sure that when they go on that pitch, they are in the best condition they can be. We give them what we give everybody. You know, individual programmes, mm -hmm. training that is specific to each game that we play and there are different games but you can't you can't legislate for Geordie pulling his calf he's come out and caught a ball landed mm -hmm. and felt like somebody kicked him um, but his calf hurt had he was on the end of a poor challenge you know listen everybody went mental when they met, like, it was a poor challenge but them lads don't usually make tackles so they probably come up you know come to hold a shot and think you know they're gonna, we're going to get kicked up in the air we'd better you know appear to be up to that sort of mm -hmm. you know combat let's say and had he's gone in there honestly and the lad's made a, a poor challenge, it's as simple as that. I'll not hold any grudges against him. And then the next one, he's gone clashed heads with the lad in centre-half mm. and their lad stayed on and our lad's come off. And then I guess we go back to league action this weekend, don't we, after two defeats now in the Cup? Is, is, is that a good opportunity to you know hit the league running and, and build some form from there? Yeah, I mean, listen, there's, I'm, I'm, I'm disappointed because we've lost a football match, but I've, I've got to look at the bigger picture. Yeah. And again, I'll say it, the people that aren't there or the people that we know we know what we're doing here we know where we want to be we know where we want to go we know where we're the, the way we want to play and certain players have to be looked after and certain players have to be exposed and I think they've exposed themselves tonight